Welcome back to Blanks No One Asked For, and in today's episode, a few Americans are going to try an assortment of Thornton's products. Blessed to try. Today's episode was made possible by Steve. A goat. You are a living goat in the flesh. Pinky's up, y'all. Yeah, pinky's up, because I have a feeling these products are quite posh. As we try these products from Thornton, we will be rating each one on our very British scale of bloody disgusting, not my cup of tea, UK, okay, lovely, lush, or oh my days. I petition to change bloody disgusting to Seabrook's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Without further ado, let's do it. All right, our very first product of today's episode, the packaging in and of itself already screams oh my days. Posh. This is the Thornton's Pearls line brownie deluxe flavor. Individually oh, wrapped. This is dangerous. Very dangerous. I wonder how big these are. Very, very, very dangerous. Brownie delight. I'm gonna keep these over here. I think Mark's gonna give these a oh my days. Hey, there. It's got brownie hey Josh, in the word, yes. Like the Walker Squares, they're in a pearl shape. <laughs> There's no pearls around. Who's pearl? Ain't that Mr. Crab Dark? Dang. All right. Tommy Delight, Pearl. Wow. Bosch is correct. Mm -hmm. That dare fancy job. <laughs> I love how everybody just went dead silent. Mm -hmm. Really trying to suck it in. Like the air just got sucked out of the room. Man. There's nothing like UK chocolate. You're eating another one. I'm eating another one. Anybody <laughs> You're eating another one. <laughs> we got a lot of Thorntons coming yeah. up. I think I'm going to save. Yep. Yeah. That's good, man. On my days. I'm going to go ahead and get it out of the way. I knew, knew as much. much. I knew as much. That you is what? I knew as much. Yeah. yeah. That's that the brownie man. Mm -hmm. That is a delectable. The brownie man. Gas man, brownie man. <laughs> <laughs> brownie man. <laughs> Changing your name. <laughs> Yeah, it's oh, we know one product going home with something else. Uh, yep, I'm gonna change my tea to milk, please. That and, would be wonderful. Uh, yeah. My ratings will all go up, but I uh, would be hard pressed to give that all my days. It is uh, very good though, so I am going to land right below that at Lush. I have hope for something else in this Thornton's package. I don't, but I'm not <laughs> basing my ratings off. That is good. I'm not a huge chocolate fan, obviously. That's really good. Um, I wish I had more of a crunchy piece in it. Was, that yeah. would make it so, so much better. Lush. I will go Lush though. I'm right there with you. Wow. It's Lush. It's great. I can't do much better than that. No matter with it. With one all my days, three Lushes, that does bring the overall average rating for the brownie pearl to Lush. Lush. Next up from Thornton's, we have probably my personal favorite, the Thornton's Pearls Salted Your Caramel Sensation. Still in the <laughs> I also hope, I know there's pictures of granulated salt on the package. Oh. I hope there's little crunches of salt in there. Yes, All right, now you're getting, you're getting too ahead of your side. I hope that there's like, it looks just like the blocks. <laughs> But, you ahead. know, when I eat a salted chocolate product, yeah. I like when they have the dusting of the salt. Not just salt flavored. I hate those for me. It might be on the inside. Oh, oh. 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 Smells good. Give me just a second. Catch your notes. Oh, you'd have been the first one. Uh, I know. I was too busy pulling myself out of the, the second whole, one. Swallowed the whole package. <laughs> All right. Salted caramel pearl. Wow. Wow. Mm. Who sent these? Steve? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jeez Louise, Steve. Budgie. Mm. I'm going to Budgie. That's good caramel. Where do you Not get Thornton's products from? Probably Thornton's. I do taste the salt. But Mr. Thornton himself handed him that. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't. yeah it's not overpowering salt. Where does cheese come from? Yeah, I do too. <laughs> not unlike another product that we. Mm -hmm. What a hater. Again, that's really good. I think that's slightly better than the last one, but they're about the same. Lush. Yeah. I'm with you. 
I can't take that one all the way, <clears throat> but it's another stellar product. I will give it another wash. I agree with that. And a lush is a good rating. Lush is a very good rating. I will also give it a third lush. <sighs> he said you were having all my day yeah. on this episode uh, for this uh, unboxing. Did so you eat your second one? Nah, I didn't. I, I don't need to because it's obviously on my days. So oh, wow. See? No. To get an all my days out of Josh is one thing, but to get the only all my days from a product out of Josh is unheard of. Steve Collins. Yeah, that is unheard of. That is good. That is amazing. Check his temperature. I love it. No temperature here. This is all natural. Well, three luscious, one skewed on my days uh, from a terrible source and an unreliable rating. Uh, not been verified, but nonetheless, uh, that brings the overall rating of the Thornton's C. I was going to say C. C the salted caramel sensation. Three lush, one on my days, to an overall rating of lush. Should be higher. Now we get to business, folks. Oh, um, great. Uh, the last of this our pearls really offering for today, uh, the Thornton's pearls, the orange velvet. It's the velvet part that I'm really looking forward to. Velvet. We've had a lot of orange products. We never had orange velvet. You can pass this down. I'll give you a little velvet keep, revolver. I'll keep, I will keep the rest of these over here. I'll just split one. These will, yeah, these these will probably cool. go in my office just like this. Mm. So are y'all popping them whole or y'all biting them? Pop them whole. I bit the first I one. I bit the first one, bit the I, second one. I popped them whole. I, like, I kind of like to see. This one's an Audi. The other like. ones have been Annie's. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that is true. This one smells far better than the other two. Mm -hmm. um, uh, that's, this is going to be next one. This is going to be on my days. Come on, nerds. You ready? Orange go. Mm. That's like zingy orange. Like there's a difference in just orange. That's like orange peel. Orange. That is delicious. Mm. <laughs> UK okay. <laughs> I've tried to give y'all an out on the orange product, but y'all yep. said no, we want to taste it. What are we going to do? Take a day off? Yeah, we're not. We're not going to do it. We're going to miss that, especially I wish you would take Taylor's a day off. I wish you would take a day off. Yeah. Orange scores, because you're a piece of crap for me. That's why. Yeah. Listen, um, it's different, and it's different for a good reason. Uh, it's very aromatic. It's everything the orange chocolate should be, and that is all my days, and that is mm, Single-handedly, one of the top three orange chocolate doing it off the Wow. On this chunk. Um, that is yet another good product. It's really good for different reasons than the other two, but I still am not going to push it over the limit. That is lush. That's fair. Let me get that uh, <clears throat> I might shock a few people with this one. Whoa. Uh-oh. Old phone. But I would probably rate that as my top orange chocolate that yeah, I have some ever, <laughs> ever <laughs> tried. I'm wow. sure. I don't think I need more. I, I, wow. uh, I didn't, See, I'm I didn't, not an evil person. I didn't take more of my caramel and I'll deny that, but um, <laughs> I'll deny I'll that. Deny that. Um, this is sent straight from God. It, it, it is very, very good for an orange chocolate. So with that being said, uh, if you say lovely, I'm going to reach across and punch you right in the jaw. <laughs> lovely. <laughs> that's lovely, and that's that's great for that's an orange chocolate rating. for me. You know, for me, lovely is like almost skewed on my days for an orange chocolate. That's, I mean, that's so, probably the highest rating I've given an orange up. chocolate. Once again, up. for possibly only the second time in this channel's history, we have yet for no another, reason. We have yet another stair step rating. We have UK OK, and not only that, but this time it's in order. It is in order. UK OK, lovely, lush, oh and my oh my days. Which I do believe, if I'm not mistaken, since we always go on the lower side of the scale, means that it is just above UK OK with an average rating of lovely. That's horrendous. Next storage product we have is Apinini Pralini. 
Did you say Gort? From Continental. I think he said opinion. I pay. I pay. I pay. I pay the food. I pay the open up the room. I pay the panini. There's a song about that panini. A panini. And if I mispronounce that, just go ahead. No, oh, if. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love how you added just the slight wrong of possibility that it was correct. Now, if you're wrong, no, Colonel Sanders. Oh, I'll get wrong. corrected. I'll get corrected. In the Mama year. said. Mama this said. Mama, 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 Mama said. Oh, not individually wrapped. Oh, okay. Oh, got a key to these dirty. A little bit of peanut butter. Since they are not individually wrapped. You get that? I've now got, got to take one to the misery. Yeah, to Alpini praline. Wow, that was soft. That oh, was really soft. That was soft. Whoa. I was not expecting that. Mm. Hey, Whoa. This, um, this dusted with finely grated white chocolate evoking the Swiss Alps. Mm. Not the Andes. I had more of that crunchy stuff in it. Mm-hmm. That's gotta be like hazelnut in it. It is. Yeah. Alpine. Mm-hmm. Wow. Really good. Everything so far has been really good. I think I've said it before, I'm not the biggest hazelnut mm. fan. Man Lovely is a good rating. Man Lovely <laughs> is a good rating. And that is. <coughs> Lovely to me. I'm gonna go a step above and go lush. That's pretty. That's pretty. I really hate to just be monotonous this episode. No, but you're going to be monotonous you're about it. You're but vanilla. it's all really good. I've just not had anything that just blows my mind. That is also lush. I agree. Uh, it's not quite the uh, delicacy that orange chocolate is, but uh, it's really good. There's no delicacy there. So it's lush. Um, I don't need any crap from the other end of the table uh, for your incorrect ratings. <laughs> so, uh, almost unanimous, but not quite. He had to remind himself of who he is. And that lovely is a good rating. Mm-hmm. And that that brings good rating. with three lushes, one lovely, mm-hmm. the overall score for the Alpini, Panini, or whatever it was that Mark said earlier, two lush. lush. Next up from Thornton's, we have the Sicilian I Moose. Thought you were about to say oh. from Sicily. <laughs> the Sicilian <laughs> Moose. Sicilian Moose would make a really good wrestler nickname. Holy oh, moly! Like that with is a moose. Gigantic. <clears throat> Has it got a fruity smell to it? It does have a fruity smell to it. Mm-hmm. Whatever Sicilian Moose is, it's got some fruit in it. Or maybe I'm wrong. That's yogurt. I hope it has That's a, a yogurt smell. Zesty lemon mousse covered in white chocolate. It's kind of like a cheesecake. Lemon, lemon juice powder lemon. and lemon juice. Okay. Zesty lemon, lemon mousse yeah. covered in white chocolate, reminiscent of Sicilian lemon groom. I knew. All right. Here we go. The nose don't lie. Sicilian mousse. Oh, wow. Mm. Whoa. Holy. Oh, wow. Definitely got that lemon in Oh, my nose. There, there we go. Say. There we go. Yeah, that lemon that. pound cake. Yeah. Cheese. What is inside that? It's like cheesecake. That's that good. is wonderful. Bam. Whoa. That's what I was missing. That's the one I got you, right? Mm-hmm. Tart. Tart. Sweet. That's incredible. Sweet. Savory. Oh, my days. Man, that's better than the orange chocolate. Oh, my days. Oh, gosh. That, we found something that he would absolutely love one orange chocolate. That I mean, may be... Yeah, that, that may be top five products I've <coughs> I, I wouldn't fight you on that one. Dude. That's top ten for sure. I definitely love that. And there's there's no problems with me saying that's all my days. So let's go. Yes. Lovely's a good rooting. Okay. Across the five. table. Across Absolutely. The table. You deserve that. You earn that. Yeah. You know what that means? <laughs> that means you're giving two all my days in the same episode. What can I say? I'll, 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 and it's not even over with yet. Not even over. Two. Yep. Across the table, four of the same ratings, unanimously with the Lemon Sicilian Moose, we give that an overall rating of the top score we can give on our channel of, oh, oh my, my days. days. And they're gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, up next from the Thornton's line, we have the Strawberries and Cream from Classic. 
I have extremely high hopes now knowing what I know about the lemon. Mm. I would have I, liked to have tried that right there first before I tried the lemon. I have that lemon for this to be is high powered. If this comes swinging, I'm actually, un I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, you. I'm, I'm sorry. You oh go. my gosh. If this comes out swinging like the Ooh, lemon did, look, it's got smell that. I know. I mean, we might just need to retire Josh if he gets. Gosh. If he gets Unlike Seabrooks, if he gets on my days, I would like to meet the Thornton CEO. <laughs> Good shake your hand for personally doing a great job. I want to shake his hand. I want to shake his hand. Yeah. Um, I'm actually really Thornton glad that we're trying it. this after the lemon because I fear. If we had tried this one first and the lemon next, Josh may not have given that one at all. Mm -hmm. okay. it's based upon how his brain works. Squawberry would have came. This is close to my heart right here. All right. <laughs> how is that better than the lemon? How is that? Why do I feel like I've just been out picking it's strawberries up. and I just stuck one in my mm -hmm. mouth? It is the ice cream bar that's got the cake pieces on the outside of it. Mm -hmm. You're both wrong. This is like an actual strawberry shortcake. Like, you know what this is? This is one of those fruit tarts mm. with strawberries. That's better than the lemon. That, that is all my days. And I may go on a limb here. That is the best chocolate I've tried on this channel. Wow. That's all that my days. Is. White chocolate with a strawberry flavored mousse center topped with pink spring oil. I mean, I mean, all my days. You can't get much better. You can't get much better than that. I will fight. I don't even know if you can get better. Than that. <laughs> so, so I guess we're gonna arm wrestle for that. And, 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 oh no, I will shoot you. <laughs> I will stab, stab you with the blade. With the blade, blade. With the gun, someone asked for. <laughs> it's on my days. I Three am. on my days in one episode. That I know. Are you, you broke like a whole you broke for you? Uh, yeah, maybe I am. Are you, I am. Are you on a diet? Something has definitely got into That is more than Josh gave all last quarter. <laughs> all last quarter. <laughs> <laughs> so, six months. I can't believe I'm saying this, but for the second product in a row, straight down the table, four consecutive and unanimous, oh, oh my, my days. Day. Stephen knows the way to my heart. All right, so just for you, Schnooks, we have a Vienna truffles. Uh, Vienna. Norton's Viennese truffle from Continental. A featherlight mousse coated with blended milk and white chocolate and topped with sugar. So is this what you would classify as hotel chocolate or is hotel chocolate its own brand? Like Thornton's and hotel chocolate or is hotel chocolate like a subcategory? I've never thought about hotel chocolate until you said something. Well, we, we've gotten a lot of recommendations in the comment to try hotel chocolate. This is covered in chocolate. Wow, nice. It's not It's light. Why we should dink these? Dink them. Dink and sink. Vienna Vienna sausage. <laughs> Ooh, I like that texture on that one. Definitely light mousse. Mm -hmm. This one's subtle. Very. But not in a bad way. Not in a bad way. You know how most of that other chocolate like really sticks on your teeth? This one seems to like get off your teeth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get off my teeth, get off my teeth. It's an upgraded three musketeers one. That's a really good yeah. put. Um, this is the, the lowest thing I've tasted today. It's still really good. Uh, and lovely is a good rating, so lovely. <laughs> I didn't like it as much as I like everything else, but it's still good, it's still really good. Yeah. I'm going back. To where I once resided. It's not all my days. I would still classify that as a lush chocolate. Yeah. It definitely is very good chocolate. Trophy. Yeah. It's nowhere near what we just shoved in our mouth just a few minutes ago. And it's like, it's it, like when Steve Carell is reading the teleprompter. I don't know, like, no, 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 no. That's what Mark just said. <laughs> I like a Duda cha cha. <laughs> it is very good chocolate. chocolate. Truffle. Truffle. <laughs> question mark? Who put a question mark on the teleprompter? Uh, after all that, I shall still give it a lovely. And lovely is a good rating. It is a good rating. <laughs> Lovely is a good rating merch coming soon.
Let's um, go with the horse trial. Two lovelies, two lushes, right? Yes. Comes out to an average score of lovely. lovely. All right, next Thor's product we have is the Crunchy Prairie Line D. Prairie Line! <laughs> oh, that's interesting. Right, it is. Huh. In the shape of a triangle. It's like a little tent. In the shape of a mountain. Probably the Andes <coughs> Mountain. Andes Mountain. All right. Here we go. Carsey Praline. Prairie Line. Do like all that texture in it. I love the texture. That little bunches of them color. crunchies that you were missing in the last few. Mm -hmm. Still, you're getting, getting in this one. Make a team Brazil nuts. Hmm. <laughs> I wish I had more crunchy. Yeah. If it had coconut, Mark would die, 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 <coughs> die before he itched. Just saying. I'm just glad. I'll give that a lovely. That's a good rating. That's a good rating. <laughs> That's good. That's better than the last. I wish I had more crunch. Crunch is welcome, though. I give that a lush. <clears throat> I will also not be moving from my previous rating. Surprise. What? There's a lot. Stand, standing as the king of house lush. <laughs> mm, it's it's right there. It's right there with that last one. The king of lush. It's right there with that last one to me. So I can't move up to lush. It's not nearly as good as the, uh, the two previous ones. Uh, the lemon and the strawberry. So for me, I'm at lovely still. And what did you say? Lovely. Disgraceful. Two lovelies. Two lushes? Mm -hmm. Well, at the stalemate, we always go with the lower rating so that we can save and reserve the higher ratings for the absolute best rated potter. And it's possible. because what we do. Which means that the overall rating for the Prairie Line. She mighty fine. Crunchy so fine. <laughs> from Classic and Thornton's comes out to an average score of lovely. lovely. All right, on the last for the Thornton's product, we have Thornton's Fudge Brownie and Mark. Already on my days. I haven't even tried it yet. I know Mark it. pronounced it Fujay Brownie. Fujay Brownie. Fujay. You got that Fujay. That's what we have to do in the UK. It's like Mark order all of our oh food. Oh <laughs> Mark needs to handle everything. The checking in at the airline. I mean, the hotel check-in, the introductions we to are here, dad. We are here for Balonkes, no one asked for. Balonkes. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, man. I'm feeling like I only want to eat half of this. I know. I, I thought the same thing. You honest with yeah, no, Mark's getting his whole one. I'm yeah. not taking hint that from him. I'll take that piece. It's <laughs> <laughs> a little small piece. All right, Zoe Bird. All right. Fudge Brownie to bring it home. Right. Yep. Oh my days. What did you say? Oh my days. You oh say it louder. Oh my days. Yeah. Oh my days. 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 Insert soy burner. Over the summer wiki. Wee wee wee. I don't know if they're different. That tastes different than the first one, but let me try. And I would say slightly better. However, still lush. I am also going the king of lush with lush. And I'm with you. I'm Although the pearls were good, and I classified them as lush too, this is lush, but it is better. I'm not sure I'm a big fan of the vehicle of the pearl with the cream on the inside. Not that it was bad. If that had whole walnuts in it, that'd be an all my days product. But I prefer this. I do too. Lush. Maybe I'm just wearing out on the the sugar thing. <laughs> yeah, we, we got two. We got three all my days out of Josh. Yeah. 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 Uh, Can't complain. I would probably. Yeah, I would definitely eat those. 
right now. But I don't I don't want any more of that. So it's like <laughs> I'm done with that. Yeah. Doing that ship is sailed. Poof! Be gone. No, it's uh it's lovely still though. And lovely's a good rating. It is. One all my days, two lushes, one lovely. The all my days and a lovely cancel each other out, which means that the overall rating for the fudge brownie comes out to a score of lush. lush. See, man. Well, uh, one of the higher ratings. This is a his, hey, yeah. history making, record shattering. Yeah. I think Josh is coming to his this guy alone. We're Maybe going to the UK in 2025 and he doesn't want to get beat up yeah. on the street. I got to so, get right first. It does right. sound like the borders were closed off to Josh after the Banafi pipe, so yeah, they yeah. may consider reopening I'm them. I'm not going. As of like last week, I'm not going. <laughs> you don't have to worry about it. This up. opens up. Uh, <laughs> you don't have to worry about him getting beat up in the UK. I'll beat him up here <laughs> for free. <laughs> So, me. thank you once again, Steve, for the Thornton's products, and again, a record-breaking episode with the high scores that were given. We'd also like to thank you all for watching, and all that leaves us to say is this has been Blank Someone Asked For, and certainly no one asked for this. But wait, there's more. Still got that itch for more blanks no one asked for? Click that bottom left video down there to see the content that YouTube thinks would be the best for you.